Do you own your own life story? If you don't, it means that you haven't really sat down and figured out what happened to me. Where did I come from? Where, what was going on in my life when I was born? Uh, what was my childhood like? All those little you know, aspects that make up who you are today. When you kind of categorize it and lay it out, inventory it, then you're ready to start talking about it. And when you're ready to start talking about it is when people are going to tell you that's not what happened. I remember it differently. It wasn't like that. And that's okay. You'll just get some different perspectives. But what's really important in your life story is what was your emotional reaction when those things happened? Because that is going to show you your resilience. If you had an emotional reaction to something really traumatic and difficult and you carried on and you carried through and you did your best and you ended up here, that's your resilient story and in your resilient story is your hero's journey. How you got from there to here and what you had to go through and how you learned and what you're still in the process of learning. That's what it means to own your life story.